The sudden snowfall is leaving shoppers scrambling and retailers rejoicing as winter items are finally flying off the shelves. KXLY 4's Alex LaFreeze joins us now live from the Sky Deck. Alex, it sounds like people are ringing in the new year with new gear. That's right, Aaron. All this snow may be wreaking havoc on motorists, but for local retailers, it means more money in their pocket. Well, we put it off as long as we could. Ben Smith waited a little too long to get geared up for the winter. We're looking for rubber boots that were warm. So we came to General Store because it's always got the boots that we're looking for. He's one of hundreds who drifted in, looking for everything from hats to hand warmers. We're out getting shovel and did some de-icer and uh, some graphite lock <laughs> stuff. Jason and Jana Houston aren't surprised to find the store packed with panicked shoppers. No, it happens every year. <laughs> Seems like everyone's surprised when it comes. But it did come, and not a minute too late. This year was extremely slow for all winter clothing, winter shoes, snow shovels, ice melt. Uh, there was just no winter, so we weren't selling anything for quite a while, and today's a little different. John Evans with the General Store says they may run out, of in-demand items. With the snow coming today, it's just been flying off the shelves. Can't, uh, can't help everybody. Boots, hats, gloves, everything. Even a few sleds. I'm probably going to go down in one of our neighbor's driveways. And her name is Margaret, so I'm probably going to go down her driveway. It's nice to know at least one person was prepared. And there's um, a big block of ice as big as that snow pile. That that I'm just going to plow out away and then I'm going to <laughs> jump that ice. Good luck, Julian. Now, the general store says they are going to be restocking their winter merchandise constantly, but they only get in one shipment of snow boots per year, so it's best to get down there before your size runs out. Reporting live on the Skydeck tonight, Alex LaFrice, KXLY4 News.